Stocks are under pressure on Friday, reversing some of the nice gains we had seen earlier in the week. This is really kind of a global sell-off. The pressure started overnight in the Chinese session as investors there responded to some regulatory actions leaning against uh, the very fast gains that had been seen in Chinese markets in recent months. It continued into the European session on, fears that, on rising fears over the potential of a Greek debt default as we head into May, with Athens quickly running out of cash with IMF debt payments coming up. As New York was about to open, the pressure continued with an outage on the Bloomberg terminal network that reduced liquidity as the cash session opened with institutional traders una unable to place trades or get quotes. So that kind of all exacerbated uh, the situation that had happened overnight. Now going forward, I think the primary factor is going to continue to be the outlook for interest rate hikes with the Federal Reserve still mulling uh, the timing and pace of a potential rate lift off. It looks like a June rate hike is going to be off the table at this point with the labor market gains slowing somewhat and inflation still relatively soft, putting a September or potentially even a December rate hike into play. I think investors are going to be, be pleased by that uh, in the months to come as the Federal Reserve reassures markets that it's going to be very cautious and really wait for the data to improve before taking action. And as a result, we should probably see stocks bounce from here and push higher into the summer months.